up in the ground any damn day. It's it's interesting play, The Cake Man. It's written in 1975. Well, that was when the first presentation was um, was was produced, and um, it's based on a family in Cowra, but it's also based on on one man's journey to find his reality. And what I really really like about this show, and where it sits for me, is that it sits in a very interesting time in Aboriginal history, and the idea of Aboriginal people dreaming and going out. Well, when I mean dreaming, like like um, you know, having having aspirations for the future and dreaming about what it is that they can do and and, and you know going out and, and grabbing a hold of life and making it their own. That idea was a very new concept. Hey, watch out for the old left. Hey. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's very universal in that you dream and you work. You can have anything, you can do anything, you can be anything. And I hope audiences get another understanding of that as they watch William struggle with the mentality and the systems in place to hold him down and to be able to dream and to actually start putting things in place to make your life better or to achieve the things that you want or to bring, you know, to give your family a better opportunity. Old bastard, can't mind his own business. Telling me I should pack up and get out of this damn stinking place. Go to Sydney, get work, get a decent place for you and Ruby and the kids. All you need is spirit. Just put your shoulders back, take a good job and get some good money. Bring Ruby and the kids to the damn shit Sydney. What I hope audiences get out of that is a sense of, of, of you know, the, the change that has happened in this country and what we have been able to, to move forward together. I mean, I have the opportunity to dream and to make things become reality through hard work and effort where, you know, my grandfather didn't. Hey, Carl! 